Hey guys, here showing you how to replace the gas pedal assembly in your 2000, 2000 through 2006 Mercedes S Class, uh, the W220 chassis. Um, if you have gotten a check engine light for a throttle position sensor, either the circuit is too high or too low, or you notice when you press on the gas pedal, the car does not actually move. Um, the throttle position sensor is located on the top of the gas pedal on these cars, not on the throttle body as most other cars would be. So as you can see, this is the old gas pedal here. Um, the throttle position sensor is this white square deal looking thing. Um, you very well might be able to just get the sensor itself as it's held on with just these uh, two screws, that one and the other one on the other side. But I just went on ahead and bought a whole new a whole new gas pedal because it's way easy to change. Um, there's only a 10 millimeter bolt that or nut that goes right here. You pop there's a cover right here. You pop it off with the flathead screwdriver, and there's one 10 millimeter nut right there that uh, needs to come off. Um, and then all you would do is disconnect this connector that's on here, and then also. You disconnect a connector back here for the kick down switch. Um, all in all, this took me about 20 minutes to do. Um, you can actually probably knock it out in 15 minutes if you're really quick. But I bought my pedal from FCP Euro. Um, if you guys have not heard of them, I would definitely go check out their website, fcpeuro.com. Um, they have good parts, good prices. I paid $120 for this pedal. Um, this is the part number right here. German pedal part number there so you can get that. And then I'll go show you the car I'm working on is this car right here. 2002 S430. And as you can see the pedal is right down there so as I said that small circle I'm not gonna actually pull this pedal back out because I just put it in um, but some guys will tell you that you need to take off all this plastic trim and whatnot but you don't need to do that the only thing you need to take off is that circle right there pop off the cover with the flathead screwdriver and like I said there is a 10 millimeter bolt or excuse me nut that's under there um, take the nut off and then all you do is come from up underneath the pedal right here you just lift it up and up off of that um, there's like a screw under there you just lift it up off of that um, it, you may have to you know pull up a little bit harder than you think but don't worry you won't hurt it and after you do that as I said before when you pull the whole pedal assembly out there are two connectors. The one was the throttle position sensor, as I told you, that white square is located up on top of the pedal. And then there's the kick down switch, which was the connector that's in the back of the pedal. So you'll see those two connectors right when you pull the pedal out. Um, there's plenty of wire, so um, you can actually pull this pedal out pretty far. I was able to pull it, you know, about all the way out here so I can uh, mess with it. And then when you reinstall your new one, simply uh, reconnect the connectors and slide it back up into its position. You will notice at the top of the pedal, I'll show you on the old pedal, that there is a little nipple that sticks out that actually locates the top of the pedal into a hole. Uh, uh, it's pretty easy to see. Like I said, this is, <clears throat> this is a really straightforward procedure, so I, I couldn't imagine that you would miss it. But I'll show you on the old pedal just in case so yeah if you uh, have gotten a check engine light for a throttle position sensor on your w220 chassis mercedes um, please don't you know go crazy looking for one on a throttle body because there is not one it's on located on the top of the pedal here so uh, these are common they do go out um, so you know for hopefully this will fix it. It fixed the problem for me and for this customer's car. So um, I will show you now the uh, 
the top of the other one so you know what the nipple is that I'm talking about so that you can um, get it all sorted. <clears throat> so here, you see that nipple there? This thing on top slides up into a hole uh, that you can see when you take out the old pedal. So, uh, after you reinstall it, just put the nut back in, tighten it back down, and put the cover back on and uh, that'll be it so um, yeah if you have any questions or concerns um, feel free to leave me a comment um, sorry I haven't posted a video in a while I will be making videos more frequently now as I have the time um, yeah if this is your first time to the channel please feel free to subscribe and um, definitely hit the like button alright guys I'll talk to you later